7 billion people in the world. Why would somebody buy from me? If that's what you're thinking, come on in. Let's do this. Hi, I'm Salma Jafri, and after quite a break, we are back with content marketing tips. Hope you missed me, the show that gives you authentic, non-icky marketing advice that you can follow. And I hope that you're subscribed because then you can follow along in your inbox and you get each episode right there. So if you're wondering, how do I differentiate myself? There are so many people out there already doing what I wanna do, then I've got a code for you. You are unique. Hmm. Just like everybody else. Now jokes aside, what this really translates into is that every single person you included has a gift, has something special to offer the world. It could be because of how you think, it could be because of your skill set. It could be because of your experiences in life. But all of those things combined, put together, make you into a unique personality. And that is something that only you have. Really, nobody has the exact same set of life circumstances and experiences that, you've, that they've been through exactly the same way as you. So you are unique. And so when you think about why would someone buy from me, it's simple, right? The answer is people will buy from you because of you. You are the secret ingredient. So you think about, mm, there's so many fashion designers already out there. Why would someone choose my designs? Or perhaps you're trying to set up a bakery and you think to yourself, you know, What's so special about my cupcakes? There's so many bakers in my city already. Or maybe you're a life coach and you wonder, why would someone choose to take advice from me? Or maybe you're a freelance writer and you think that there's so many writers out there. Why would someone hire my opinions and pay me to write my voice? And that's the whole point of it. People will pay you for being you. All right, so let's take an example. Supposing you are a fashion designer, right? And you have this edgy style, maybe a little grungy, and that's who you are, that's your personality. And the natural way that you're gonna express that is in your designs, right? You're gonna express your personality in your design. Now think back to any other pr profession, right? Say you're a freelance writer, and you, the way that you write you know, the words you use, the, the short or long sentences, the, the emotions that you convey in your writing are an extension of your personality. You write according to who you are and what you think. So when somebody chooses your writing, you know, from all the other writers out there, they are choosing you. They are saying that I like your style. When they buy clothes from you, they are saying I can relate to what your artistic expression is of your business. So when you ever get into this, you know, bad place where you think, why would anyone buy from me? And you're wondering whether to even start your business or how do you market your business? Well, then think about that. Think that your personal style and you is why people buy from you. Now, how does all of this relate to your marketing? Glad you asked. So once you know why somebody would buy from you, once you have your why, then what you wanna do is bleed that, bleed your personality, bleed your why from every channel available to you. And that includes social media, that includes online events, offline events, networking, people meeting. Every chance you get to talk about yourself and your business, you bleed the reason why somebody would buy from you. So maybe that reason is because this is who I am. This is what I represent. This is my lifestyle. This is my style. And therefore, you get to talk about that everywhere. And that has a snowball effect. If you're talking about the same thing on all the channels, people see that, all right, this is her. And they get a complete picture of who you are. This entire episode basically you can use to understand that A, you are unique, 
and B, you have to use that uniqueness and that is why people come to you and you have to put that out there everywhere that you can. If you like this episode, I would love it if you shared it with all your friends and your you know, people and your communities and your Facebook groups and everywhere and please stay subscribed because I am releasing an ebook soon which is gonna tell you even more ways to be authentic and to promote yourself and you wanna go to salmajafri.com slash subscribe and put your email in there so that we can stay in touch one-on-one. -on -one. Thank you so much for watching. Take care.